Hi guys, so this is going to be a Costco haul. Finally made it to Costco. Today is Wednesday. I meant to go last Wednesday, but you know, getting in a car accident kind of got in the way of that. I was going to Costco when the accident happened, but before that, so um, something else happened in the process and I got in a car accident and I never made it to Costco. So fast forward a week later, finally made it there. I spent $139.99, so $140. And I'll start right over here. So I got two of these because they were on sale. These are the gummies that I take every day. You take two a day. It's just the Nature's Bounty hair, skin, and nails. And so far, so good. I haven't been breaking out because I usually have problems with the biotin. I took biotin a while back and I broke out like I was in high school, no joke. And I kind of stirred away from it for a little while, but I have my best friend takes these and she swears by them. So I've actually been taking the, these for a while. I just bought them at Target when I did. And this is such a good deal. There's 230 gummies and they're actually right now on sale for like nine something. So got that. Got this, never have had it from Costco. I've tried it from other places. Um, it is just a two pack of quiche and I didn't think they were expensive. I know they're probably super easy to make, but I'm not a cook. So they're uh, cheddar and broccoli. Um, and there's two of them obviously in here. So, and I think this was like 10 something. Let me see if I can find it quickly in the receipt. Uh, it was eleven forty nine, so not bad. I mean, if you counted all the work and stuff that you got to put into it, I'd rather pay eleven forty nine than make them myself. I also grabbed these. I have been meaning to grab these last few times that I've gone, but I forget. It is just the teriyaki and pineapple uh, chicken meatballs. There's a two pack in here, and I love these because you can just make some white rice with that. And I want to say those were thirteen seventy nine, so not bad. Grabbed my usual um, croissant ginormous pack. I like to use these in the morning for um, breakfast, like breakfast croissants. But I also bought them with keeping in mind that I wanted to buy chicken salad because I saw this TikTok video of this girl trying out chicken salad from Costco and she said it was like so good so been meaning to buy it and I did which is right here it was a little pricey but if you again if you count you know how it is to make it I'd rather buy it so got some rotisserie chicken salad and it says with a with eggless mayonnaise interesting so that was that grab some of our favorite um cheese this stuff is awesome especially if you're making quesadillas it melts so evenly and it just it melts it melts perfectly let's just say that so delicious pepper jack cheese got the signature rotisserie chicken which i swear these things are huge compared to the ones at walmart for the exact same price $4.99 pretty sure i'm looking at the receipt yes $4.99 so grab that grab some paper towels i also grabbed a case of pepsis which they are still in my car because i had to bring in all this by myself because kids are in school so grab some paper towels Moving back here, don't mind this. I am like reorganizing my pantry. I got these at um, TJ Maxx yesterday and I wanted to reorganize like all of my kids' um, snacks and stuff that they take to school in their lunchbox. So I wanted to do that and I just wanted them to look prettier in the pantry versus all the box and everything and it looks like a jumbled mess. So that's out because I'm still working on that. Moving on over here, I grabbed a ginormous bag. What is this? A pound and 12 ounces of Ruffles. And I also grabbed one of the Doritos. Had they been on sale, I would have got, you know, a couple of bags because summer's coming, kids are home all the time, and they're hungry all the time. So just grab one of these, but I will be keeping an eye on those. These, however, were on sale. They were from $5.99. There was $2 off, what, making them $3.99, $2.99. Um, they're the Cheez-Its Snapped Cheesy Thin and Crispy. 
And this is a pretty good bag too. It is a pound and four ounces. So I did obviously grab two of those. And then lastly, I just grabbed some of my favorite bacon. It's just the Hormel fully cooked bacon. Um, this lasts a little bit, even though, you know, when there's all six of us here, this goes through quickly, but I don't mind it because it just takes the hassle of cooking bacon. So it's totally worth it. I think it's like between 10 and $12. Totally worth it because you can easily just pop some in the microwave and you have bacon with whatever it is that you're eating bacon with. So that is that. Like I said, I spent $139.99. So basically $140. So not bad. Like I said, the only thing that is still in my car is the case of Pepsis. So I hope you guys are having a great day and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye.